Chapter 12, Success. Every experience is a success. What does failure mean anyway? Does it mean that something did not turn out the way you wanted it to or the way you were hoping? The law of experience is always perfect. We outpicture our inner thoughts and beliefs perfectly. You must have left out a step or had an inner belief that told you you did not deserve or that you felt unworthy. It's the same way as when I work with my computer. If there's a mistake, it's always me. It is something I have not done to comply with the laws of the computer. It only means that there is something else for me to learn. The old saying, if at first you don't succeed, try, try again, is so true. It doesn't mean beat yourself up and try the same old way again. It means recognize your error and try another way until you learn to do it correctly. I think it's our natural birthright to go from success to success all our life. If we are not doing that, either we are not in tune with our innate capabilities, or we do not believe it can be true for us, or we do not recognize our successes. When we set standards that are much too high for where we are at this moment, standards that we cannot possibly achieve right now, then we will always fail. When a little child is learning to walk or talk, we encourage it and praise it for every tiny improvement the child makes. The child beams and eagerly tries to do better. Is this the way you encourage yourself when you're learning something new? Or do you make it harder to learn because you tell yourself that you're stupid or clumsy or a failure? Only by practicing over and over do we learn the new and make it a natural part of us. When you watch an accomplished professional in any field, you are looking at innumerable hours of practice. Don't do what I used to do. I would refuse to try anything new because I didn't know how to do it and I didn't want to appear foolish. Learning is making mistakes until our subconscious mind can put together the right pictures. It doesn't matter how long you've been thinking of yourself as a failure. You can begin to create a success pattern now. We need to plant the seeds of success. These seeds will grow into an abundant harvest. Here are some success affirmations you can use. Divine intelligence gives me all the ideas I can use. Everything I touch is a success. There is plenty for everyone, including me. There are plenty of customers for my services. I establish a new awareness of success. I move into the winning circle. I am a magnet for divine prosperity. I am blessed beyond my fondest dreams. Riches of every sort are drawn to me. Golden opportunities are everywhere for me, and I accept them. Pick one of the affirmations and repeat it for several days. Then pick another and do the same. Allow these ideas to fill your consciousness. Don't worry about how to accomplish this. The opportunities will come your way. Trust the intelligence within you to lead you and guide you. You deserve to be a success in every area of your life. In the infinity of life where I am, all is perfect, whole, and complete. I am one with the power that created me. I have within me all the ingredients for success. I now allow success to flow through me and manifest in my world. Whatever I am guided to do will be a success. I learn from every experience. I go from success to success and from glory to glory. My pathway is a series of stepping stones to ever greater successes. All is well in my world.